The Stray Dog by Mark Simont From a True Story by Reiko Sasha It was a great day for a picnic. What's this? asked the father. It's a scruffy little dog, said the mother. He looks hungry, said the girl. I think he wants to play, said the boy. The children played with him and taught him to sit up. They named him Willie. They kept playing until it was time to go. Let's take Willie home, said the children. No, said the father. He must belong to somebody, explained the mother, and they would miss him. On the way home, the girl said, maybe Willie doesn't belong to anybody. During the week, all the family had Willie on their minds. Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Willie, they all cried when he appeared. But Willie didn't stop. Willie was in a big hurry. The dog warden chased Willie through the park. The kids were close behind. Willie was really fast. He has no collar. He has no leash, said the dog warden. This dog is a stray. He doesn't belong to anyone. The boy took off his belt. Here's his collar, he said. The girl took off her hair ribbon. Here's his leash, she said. His name is Willie, and he belongs to us. Okay, said the warden. The kids were so happy, they had their own dog. They took Willie home, and after that, they gave him a bath. They brushed him and put flea and tick powder on him. They introduced him to the neighborhood where he met some very interesting dogs at the dog park. Willie even rubbed noses with a French poodle. Billy found a new home and settled in right where he belonged. This book won a medal for its illustrations. I hope you liked it.